Hi, this is Michelle and today I thought that I'd bring you some tips and tricks on diluting products and I know that this is an area that confuses people a little if they haven't used a dilution method before. So we're trying to break it down and make it very simple because once you've used a dilution method you will never go back to using shampoos concentrated. So, first of all, when you get your bottle of shampoo, there's a temptation to dilute the whole bottle so that you don't have to do that again. And I would say, please never do that for any product or any brand. The reason behind that is that when we formulate a product, we put in the preservative to cover the product as it is so that it has good shelf life and that it will be preserved just as it has been bottled. However, when you add water to this product, the ingredients have a beautiful feeding source for bacteria, yeast and mould, something that we do not um, want in our product and to be pouring over our dogs and also for us also to have our hands in it. So uh, bacteria, yeast and mould is, is in all water or most waters. So we cannot put in enough preservative to cover water that can be added later on. The reason that we can't do that is that it would be just too much. It would not meet regulations that we have to adhere to. And also, when we put in too much preservative, it can act as an irritant, which we don't want for our dogs or also for ourselves. So when you dilute the product, make sure that you use it within the day. Um, I tend to think um, as well, you don't want to be pouring cold um, product over your dogs. And it also then, especially conditioners, um, it can start to separate again. So just make sure that when you dilute the product that you use it that day and you will be sure that the preservative um, that is added into the product to protect the product will be fine for that particular day. Now, when it comes to how much you should dilute um, the product, that's all dependent upon so many different um, situations and also on you and your dog. We say that our shampoos and conditioners, we recommend a starting dilution rate of 30 parts of water to one part of product. But it is dependent upon the individual dog, the condition of the coat, how clean that they are or not, if you have a particularly dry coat, if you have a dog that needs more product to hang the coat properly, if you have a drop coated breed, and also um, the water that you will be using. So my go-to with this is start out with a 30 to one ratio. If you need more product, you're just not getting the finish that you want, increase your product in there. If you have a little bit of a play, Again, it's going to depend upon your individual dog. And look, some dogs um, within your dogs at home, if you have more than one dog, you will find that some dog's bathing ratio um, and program should be maybe different to another. So that is something for you to play with. Now, how do you dilute? There's various different methods. If you're, of course, using a hydro bath or you're using a surge pump system, it's quite easy and you would be used to doing um, that and, and, um, and diluting your product. Um, I get asked, how much should I use in a hydro bath? It is going to depend upon your hydro bath, um, the sort of pump that you have and also the size of the tank. So it's, again, a little bit to play with on that. But... For everyone else, um, diluting your product, you can use several different methods. Um, you can use one of these dilution bottles, or you can use something like this, which is very tired. It's been used a lot. One of your Gatorade or Powerade type bottles. Um, it's great to use, and it's got a fantastic top. 
um, to actually pour over. So that's quite an inexpensive thing to use. And of course you're recycling as well. Something like this, the dilution bottles, uh, you can buy, your, buy them from your grooming supplies. A lot of your hairdressing supply places will sell these. If you're in the US, I know that Sally's has them. Or you can use um, a sauce ketchup mustard bottle, um, which works quite well. Um, I don't go using these two because we have used a dilution rate to explain to people on how much product that they should use. And these are both 600 ml. So what I say in 600 ml is nine pumps of product. So first of all, put your nine pumps into your bottle, nine pumps of product, fill it up a little with hot water, Give it a good swirl around and then fill it up with warm water and you're ready to use. Now I've had a few people that add the water first and then add the product and I know a lot of dilution bottles say to do that and they're marked to do that. To me that doesn't work. Um, you're not diluting the product properly, especially when it comes to conditioner. Now when we manufacture conditioner, a lot of the ingredients in that are beautiful um, are butters and oils, and that we use a progress of uh, a process of heat to actually dilute that or liquefy that product, so then we can formulate it. So if you're adding heat to it, it will help break it down. And a lot of our conditioners, especially um, something like our intensive care conditioner, it's quite a heavy conditioner. So you really need a little bit of heat in there to melt all of those beautiful oils. Um, put the heat in it, swirl it around again, and fill it up with water. Then again, you're ready to use. Something else that you can use, and you can purchase these very inexpensively from your department stores. I bought this one yesterday, a new one, and it was very, very cheap. Um, these are good enough to do the job. So um, they are just your kitchen, normal kitchen blender. Again, that they normally come with a, a great little jug there, a great little um, to which has your measurements on there. So again, add, hot uh, add your product add your hot water make sure that it's about a third filled put this in and blitz away um, until you're happy with it and then fill it up with your warm water and use it just on your dog you can pour it then into one of your mixing bottles um, again within the fraser essentials range you can dilute products together so some of my favorites are um, the Coat Stimulant Shampoo and one of our um, colored shampoos that works really well, or um, one of our um, Coat Stimulant Shampoo or Squeaky Clean Shampoo combined with our big volumizing shampoo. So that's a bit about dilution and um, I hope that that makes a little more sense Again, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact one of our stockers um, or send an email through to inquiries at FraserEssentials.com. Um, we love uh, having all of our um, lovely customers tagging us in on their Facebook and Instagram posts. So please continue to do that, hashtag FraserEssentials. And we'll talk to you again soon. Bye.